Capricorn, I want to thank you for all of your subscriptions, all of your likes. Um, if you found this reading, you're probably meant to. If it resonates, do like and share and subscribe. Click the notification bell to all. This is going to be a follow-up to your April 2022 reading. We're going to look at uh, the past, why someone here in this relationship or connection cannot divorce themselves from the past. Um, if you haven't watched the April 22 reading and these messages resonate with you, please do so. And if they do, do like, share, and subscribe. I would appreciate it. Keep in mind that energies do go both ways. There will be an extended. Um, this is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. We're going to look at the issue at hand as it relates to the past energy and why somebody can't move on from it why it's lingering we're going to look at the problem we're going to look at how your person feels about the issue how you feel about the issue the resolution will there be a resolution why or why not and spirits messages we're also going to pull some angel oracle for you capricorn keep in mind time is fluid compassion Compassion. I'm not even going to go to the Oracle book for that. I think it's self-explanatory. So let's look at the problem here as it relates to the past. Ace of Swords. Reversed. Someone's not communicating. What's going on here? How do you feel about the issue? Capricorn, remember roles are reversed. Ace of Swords, reversed. How does Capricorn feel about this issue, the past issue? Why does the past keep lurking its head into this connection with Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node? How does Capricorn feel? Queen of Pentacles, reversed. How does your person feel? How does your person feel? The tower reversed. Hmm. No wonder you're not uh, communicating here. What's the resolution? Nobody wants to talk about the elephant in the room. Resolution. The lovers. Will it or will it not be resolved and why or why not? Will it? One card please. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. That wants to fly out. Damn fool. In reverse. Well, if you're not communicating about anything, then what the hell do you expect is going to happen? Why or why not? Oh, happy. Why or why not? I'm going to put down the bottle. I don't want to fight anymore. And spirits messages, bottom of the deck, judgment, call to action, forgiveness, resurrection, second chances. Okay? And spying energy, death, rebirth, regeneration, transformation. What's going on? Oh, compassion. So your problem here is a lack of clarity. There needs to be, two of you need to, your past issue here, either you or your person or both of you don't want to go back and relive the past or you don't want to go back to a past situation or you don't want the past to rear its head again the way that it did, all right? Yet, the Spirit's message here is judgment. So there is a need to go back to the past. Judgment is a long outstanding 
energy of do we give this a second chance? This has been going on over and over and over again. Okay, so the issue here, the problem is there needs to be a discussion. Okay, um, there is no clarity. We need to discuss this. Someone is unclear about how they feel about this past situation. And the Nine of Pentacles reversed. More on this one, please. Thank you. Um, sensing a false start, the King of Wands reversed. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. And the Six of Swords. Okay. The problem is we're not discussing where we were as it relates to our independence. You know, the Nine of Pentacles is a very independent energy, okay? Were we, were we not committed? Uh, where was our relationship? Where is our relationship? Where is this connection? King or Queen of Wands in the reversed and the Six of Swords. I'm sensing there's there's an overall message of a need to move on from the past. A need to not even want to discuss this. Yet Judgment is saying in order to... Because Judgment is also a resurrection. So how do you know where you're at and where you're going if you don't know where you've been? Right? So in order for there to be forgiveness and second chances with this Ace of Swords, in order to move on, because this is the issue as it relates to the past, you need there needs to be a discussion. So, Kevin, you're coming in again, reverse the roles, and, and it needs to be done with compassion. Which I said I wasn't going to go to the Oracle, but I feel the need to. The answer to your question involves treating those around you in the same way in which you wish to be treated. It reminds you how you act affects everything and everyone in your life. This is a time to show the higher part of yourself. You can easily detach and see the big picture in every situation and to move forward, you must exude higher energy because what you give out is what you receive. So check in with yourself and take inventory to ensure that you are treating others with fairness and compassion. You're coming in um, feeling about the situation in your own element, okay? Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, yet you're not giving this with the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, the, the nurturing stability that it needs. Okay, um, again, Nine of Pentacles is also Earth energy, could be dealing with a fire sign, you just want to move on from this, the problem here is no, you don't want to discuss it, you or your person, but this is the problem that both of you are, are sharing together, yet there's a need here for um, forgiveness and second chances and a call to action as to what is going to happen compassionately. So, you're withholding. Reverse it as you need to reverse it. Yet, it seems here your energy is withholding. 
Don't want to go back to the past. Yet there's an overwhelming sense, especially with the resolution, to choose. You have both the lovers and judgment. Why is Capricorn coming up the Queen of Pentacles reversed? The Five of Wands. Conflict. Temperance. Sagittarian energy. You know, doing nothing is doing something, but it's still doing nothing. So you have temperance, judgment, the lovers. One more, please. Death reversed. Exactly. Okay. Now you have your energy here being released. So toxicity is being released. Um, yet, as I said, doing nothing is doing something. So there is no trans transformation happening. If indeed you're here, okay, is sitting in the five of wands energy, not budging, not moving, withholding, being combative, hoping for, even though being patient, okay, in hopes that this situation is just going to go away, it's not. Death reversed. It's not going to transform on its own. It, the only way it's going to transform is if you or your person or the both of you do something to implement the change that is necessary in order for this situation to transform. Energy is neither created nor, nor destroyed, right? Um, yet, you, I, I feel as though with this, this energy, again, it goes both ways. Your partner here is avoiding a tower moment in part i'm sensing it feels as though it's like they're walking on eggshells you're just thinking that this is just going to go away you don't want to relive something yet on the bottom of the deck is death upright the the past needs to be addressed and that's in part what this page of swords is suggesting you have judgment, call to action, forgiveness, second chances, resurrection. It needs to be discussed with this page of swords. That's in part what the page of swords says. Okay, it's a page, um, it's swords energy. We need to discuss this, albeit, okay, maybe on very lightly, uh, you know, tenderly, on a, on a very... In order for there to be this transformation, because the problem here is you have the Ace of Swords reversed. And there needs to be a, a forward movement. The past needs to be discussed. And it seems here you're withholding patiently, just expecting for this, this confrontation to just go away, yet nothing is being transformed. There's no new beginning here with death reversed. Your person is avoiding a tower moment. It, it's being released, yet not in the manner in which it's going to get you to your resolution with there being a choice. And choices can't be had unless it's discussion, unless there's a discussion. So tower reverse, please, for your person. Death reversed. Uh, excuse me, devil reversed. Oh my god. Capricorn, I feel as though they're, again, like I said, they're walking on eggshells. They're, um, 
whatever this past situation is, it, it very well, there, perhaps the reason it's not being discussed is because it is a tower moment to discuss it. It might have been toxic, it might have been hurtful, it might have been painful, it could have been a third party, it could have been cheating, that Nine of Pentacles reversed. It, whatever it was, it needs to be discussed with compassion. More on this one, please. Devil reversed, tower reversed for Capricorn's person, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node. If these messages resonate, please do like, share, and subscribe. Click the notification bell to all. There will be an extended reading. I'd like to get into the subconscious and see exactly what's going on with this past energy. Five of Swords reversed. This was an external um, energy in the past. Five of Swords speaks to one upmanship as it relates to commitment. Someone doesn't want the past to return. It's that simple. Justice. And the Page of Swords, again, look at this. It has to do with a commitment, okay? Justice is all, of, it's Libra energy. It's the seventh house. It's contracts, partnerships, commitment, balance, karma, truth, harmony. Um, and again, with the Page of Swords in reverse, there, there needs to be a conversation as it relates to this because why? We need clarity. That's your problem here. That's the issue. We don't have this new beginning as it relates to what needs to be discussed. One more on this. Someone feels defeated or felt defeated. Some external energy in the past got in the way of this. And for whatever reason, it's not the two of you are having an issue it's like as though if you discuss it, you, you bring it back to life. Or if you discuss it, you um, invite it back in, I'm feeling. One more. So it's like, let's like ignore it. And if we ignore it, it goes away. It doesn't work that way. Whoa, this one flipped. There you go. That one wanted to come out. Justice again at the bottom of the deck in the upright. It's the deception. Something, someone that got in, in the way of this in the past. Um, some lying, cheating, deceptive energy. It could have been you, could have been your person. It could have been a third party. Some toxic, negative, whatever this devil energy is that's past. That currently has not been transformed and released and let go, okay, that isn't being discussed, that's leading us right to the present moment, which is the resol resolution, okay, of the situation that's creating this choice, this second chance, okay? What are we going to do now? We know where we've been. We know where we're at, okay? In order to move forward, we have to discuss where we've been and where we are in order to make this choice to move forward lovers capricorn sun moon rising venus in north no we have the three of cups reversed this is a third party past energy deceptive um competition and it's just not on the table more on this please And I feel one or both of you are, are scared that one or the other might go back to this or that it might return. Thank you. Hermit, going within for enlightenment. Yeah, we're asking ourselves, like, we're, we're going within. And um, before we make a decision, before we move forward, yeah, in and out energy. Knight of Wands.
Three of Cups reversed on that lovers before we make a decision. Three of Cups is, um, you know, it's celebration. It, it can be gossip too. It's third party. It's um, going out, having a good time. Could be dating, dating other people. Um, but with that, with that hermit, we are going within for enlightenment before we take another step forward as it relates to some player energy. Knowing that this is going to be the right decision, this second chance, okay? Or, you know, I'm not going to give this a second chance. I'm not going to choose, choose love without ensuring that that past energy, this deceptive devil energy, I, we want to avoid a tower moment here. And even in discussing this is, is bringing the past back to the present moment. Hence the reason we don't want to take that leap of faith. And even in having that discussion is taking a leap of faith and in, in, in bringing it back up. It's like resurrecting the past energy that we are so fearful of scratching the surface and doing in the first place. That's what's going on here. Ace of Wands reversed. It, the, the fear of having this renewal of a new beginning or um, taking this leap of faith with this this passionate um, new beginning yet again so scared and the ace of cups the ace of wands reverse the ace of cups reverse as it relates to this fool because we're not discussing it we're not clear judgment judgment Resurrection, new beginning, second chances, forgiveness, call to action, choice in love, lovers, because we're just not talking about it. There needs to be transformation. Why? Fear, choice in love, fear to a cops reversed but remember what this whole entire reading is about the problem of the past the subconscious what's going on underneath the surface the fears of that path and that choice of what happened in the past with the two of cups so Taking that leap of faith and having this, this renewal, that new beginning, yet again, with the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Wands, that Two of Cups is has everything to do with fear and the choice. The moon is choice. The moon is fear. The lovers is choice. So we're going to go within because we don't want, the, again, that back and forth, in and out energy of what happened in the past. So... We then, you or your person, or both of you, right, avoiding this tower moment, not wanting to have this discussion of this past deception, um, not wanting to transform the, the situation, judgment, call to action, resurrection, second chances, do we or don't we, right? So instead of transforming, we're just going to wait patiently and wait and see and not fight for this. Ridiculous. Listen to our intuition and not speak. Choice again. This is a choice. It's a choice, again, like I said, the Spirit said earlier, doing nothing is still doing something, but it's doing nothing. Nine of Wands reversed, judgment reversed. Doing nothing is doing something. Why? Because we're not talking about it. We're not clear. Again, it's so clear. So while you, so your Spirit's message are, you must talk, you must do that, you must... It's important you give this forgiveness, compassion, forgiveness. I mean, these, listen, same energy, okay? Speak with compassion, have a conversation. Where have you been? So where are you going? Transform the situation, all right? Because you don't want an in and out energy. You both know this. This is exactly what you need, okay? But you're not, you're going to put down the fight. All right. When nine of wands, since you've come so far, should become the ten of wands, 
and put down the burden. Instead, you know what? I fought so many battles. I'm not even going to win the war. Nope. Why? Because I'd rather not even I'd rather not even give this a second chance when Spirit's message is saying you should. This is what you should do. Another one on this. This is going to go to the extended. We're going to look at the subconscious and emotives of your person, how they view you. This is this is everything about the past rearing its ugly head and being too scared to talk about it coming out of because you just rather not rather not deal with it it i have enough anxiety over it you know it's not worth fighting for nine of swords in reversed one more on this capricorn sun moon rising venus and north node Just gonna work on myself for right now. Doing something or not doing something is doing doing nothing is doing something. However, the two of you can't walk away from one another. Absolutely not. And this situation is going nowhere until you have this discussion. So I would like to see in the extended what the subconscious feelings, intentions, perceptions are because until this conversation is had, judgment, there's still a judgment call. Outstanding. Capricorn, that's what I have for you. Please like, share, subscribe if these messages resonate. Until next time, luminous, light, love, and blessings always. The extended is down below. Peace.